was another way. fled into the tree line. It was then you realized you were the sole survivor. You set off to locate the bunker. You never mentioned the house in your debrief. Time to move along. The path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork not the trail to the left. You heard Russian voices from a cave across the river, so you went to investigate. Bell, I need you to turn around and go into the cave.
found the bunker by going into the cave. Why is... Since the scenario 17? A tunnel? You... Okay, you pulled out your sidearm and flashlight. Stop lying, Bell. Start again and tell me how you met Perseus. Christ, what's happening to him? The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. We've got a job to do. Let's up the dosage and run 1B this time. Okay, ready. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. You readied your bow to take them out silently.
The path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. The zip line nearby was the best way to go. We wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. No, Bell. You found the bunker by going into the cave. Equipped your shotgun and had a boat. That's when you discovered VC soldiers meeting with Soviet agents. Let's keep the story moving. Yes, Bell. That was the door into the Soviet bunker.
Don't stop, Bell. Fuck, fuck. Hand me the fallback scenario manual. Here it is. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. path split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. Stop fighting me, Bell, and go left. Turn around, Bell, and take the other path. a rope ladder leading to a bridge overhead. The bridge led toward the bunker, so you climbed the ladder. Bell, use the ladder to your left. Crossing a bridge near a village. The bunker was somewhere on the other side. Bell, the bunker isn't there. Turn back. Now.
Yes, this was the bunker entrance you described in the report. I don't care if the door was fucking stuck. Open it. Give Bell another injection. That could be lethal. Bell's heart rate is... Do it, now! Heart rate is spiking. I'm not sure how much longer Bell can last. Wasting my time with this hallway. What the lab? What the hell is Bell doing in the lab? Bell, forget about the damn lab. I need to know about the bunker. Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume our...
Can Bell survive another round? Now you're asking me. Do it. We're not leaving empty-handed. Script 17. Ready. Bell. We've been over this already. Skip ahead, next time. The bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. Bell, go into the bunker now. Bell, open the door. States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. I gotta admit, I'm surprised. I didn't think they'd recover so fast. We tried everything. Normal forms of interrogation weren't working. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. And now the training is complete. We just need to give the subject a name. Bell. He's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? What you're going through now is nothing compared to what you'll experience if you don't start cooperating. We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. 
left you for dead. When the plane leaves traps on his stopping in Duba, this you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duba alive. We'll dump the bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. We were there. We found you after everything went down. The CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. Are your hands clean, Bell? Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. I don't think so. You're still holding back on us, and we are gonna get it out of you. We have a job to do. Bell, we've got a job. We've got a job to do. We've got a job to do. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now. What we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. From the safety of Solovetsky. Solvetsky. This is your chance to define who you really are, Bell. Where is Perseus? From the safety of Solovetsky. 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 Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else, gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. You're still one of us. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. 
The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us have crossed the line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. That ends now. Coming up on your right. Belikov really came through in the Soviet armor. Not time you got on it. No way I'm missing this. Motherfuckers are gonna pay for right to Lazar. Look at you, Sam. Solovetsky's two clicks out. All units, EMP in transit. Starfish inbound, 400 knots. When that baby hits, we'll have 12 minutes max before the radio towers come back online. Our job is to knock out the AA guns and give our warbirds a clean shot. Let's take Perseus off the air. 